Well, today is March 25th, 2021. I'm at Hardy Family Ford, and we got a little delivery last night. And I'm, of course, out here to, to do the walk around. So I just thought I would give a, a little presentation. I'm sure the wind, it's kind of windy today, showing what it looks like. The color is great, and we ordered the optional uh, carbonized gray roof, which really contrasts well, in my opinion, with the, the Area 51 blue. So, naturally we have a loud Mustang V6 going by. So we're going to just do the walk around. Um, well, as people know, but I'll just show you, you've got two glass options. You've got the good old style hatch where you can just come in reach in and put things, take things out. And if you're at the Home Depot and have a long board, now you can have it go out the glass versus the whole hatch. So let's close this. Open this. The downside is it has a pop release, but it does not have a auto opening rear hatch. Uh, I don't know why they didn't do that. I think the escape has it, but which this is based off of but anyhow we can at least uh, I'm not a brewski person, but you got a little cup hold I mean a cup holder a, a bottle opener which are hard to come by nowadays We can do our Christmas lights we've uh, Opening it for the first time you can plug your Christmas lights in and be real decorated. Lots of chargers, lots of special hook things. It's got these spotlights, which, well, let me turn that on again. Well, maybe you don't. Well, I'll have to see. I don't know, without the key, maybe it doesn't want to come on. But there, these little adjustable things right there on both sides. And I've seen them on YouTube lit up, and boy, they really cast a big light down. These are supposedly where you can put some old hangers and hang things to dry if you want. So they got it set up. There's your backup camera I ordered the bigger tires but the Badlands standard rims uh, they have some aluminum ones that look like steelies but I don't know I just like the the look of the you know fancy rim they're 17 inches, so they've got plenty of tire absorption so that you can handle the ruts. And the Badlands is more of the off-road edition, so it's got a little bit higher um, body height. It's jacked up, I think, about an inch higher than the, the standard Bronco Sports. So I'll just show briefly the the interior it's still in the wrapper but it has this nice suede material and a little Bronco down there on it and then as my father-in-law used to always say Ken likes his leather and there's leather seating and kind of a a camel color brown I, I like it and then we've got all of the off-road goat modes as they call it we actually rented a uh, Pacifica 
minivan because I sold the the Super Duty and it has one of these twist transmission levers and we actually adjusted to it real easily so we're looking forward to that function oh and for you Red Bull drinkers which I am not the little center cup holder is for the little narrow Red Bull cans and then your regular conventional cup holders on either side it also has a rubberized floor and it comes with carpeted floor mats but it's got rubber floor for for extra durability and you know they've got all these little map pocket areas and it's got a self charging uh, one of those where you drop your cell phone and it auto charges it so we're looking forward to that well we got to upgrade our cell phone somehow our cheap cell phone doesn't have that feature you got to plug it in to a USB which it has plenty of those ports for that and then you can't see but there's a deep a deep uh, storage bin there so that's all I'm gonna show for now and we look forward to getting delivery in a few days we got some bad weather coming up and I don't want to get delivery with bad weather let me do the walk around to the front I can't remember if I even showed the front I wasn't a fan of the Bronco Sport until I saw some uncamouflaged pictures of it and I thought you know that thing's kind of cute so we're looking forward to having 250 horsepower from a four-cylinder EcoBoost and it's supposedly quite quick I, I was watching some 0 to 60 times with it and quarter mile times it likes premium to get the most horsepower but it will run on regular so we're not going to get the most boosted pressure out of it we'll we'll run on regular so we'll talk to you soon bye bye